Senate, come to order. Mr. Secretary, open the machines for roll call, please. Vote your machines, please. Senator Gallo is here. Senator Johns. Senator Broom. Senator Chabert. You through voting? I close them out, please. 33 members uh, present in the quorum today. Uh, Senator Rick Gallo will introduce the visiting clergy. Thank you, Mr. President. Members, um, it's an incredible honor to um, introduce this young man today. He's uh, actually my session aide uh, right now. His name is uh, Jonathan Allen, Minister Jonathan Allen. Uh, he's a recent uh, graduate of Grambling State University, he served uh, this past year as the uh, student government president. Uh, he was called to preach at the age of 11, uh, delivering his first sermon at 11. He was licensed at the age of 14 and ordained uh, at the age of 20. Uh, he will uh, only be with us for two weeks. Uh, he'll leave next week going to Israel. Uh, this young man has an incredible talent, an incredible uh, anointing, and we're just uh, incredibly uh, excited to have him here today. So without further ado, Minister Jonathan Allen. With all his bowed, our God, God Almighty, God of peace, of love, and power, we call you our God because you have no respect of persons. You reign over the just as well as the unjust. You're the same God that gives wisdom to the Democrats and guidance to the Republicans. So we come before you at this fourth hour of the afternoon seeking clarity and direction. We thank you for every blessing that you bestowed upon us. We are grateful for even the return of Senator John Smith in perfect health. Even as I pray, I ask and beckon your spirit to cover every leader in this chamber. Help them, help us, to not be as concerned about political agendas as we are about public ailments and aspirations. I pray that you release a presence of unity amongst these public servants. Though the session is in its final weeks, we declare and anticipate that great, mighty, and triumphant strides and efforts will be made and accomplished to empower the great state of Louisiana. We expect that the lives of every Louisiana citizen will never be the same, that you are using the leaders to represent the better, complete, and total good of the constituents of the state of Louisiana. A commitment you have made and have allowed them to make to every constituent, we ask that these commitments of sacrifice, endurance, honesty, and integrity be made whole. Now, God, place your hand upon their hearts and their lives. We ask that you protect them, protect their families, and preserve their dignities as they pave the way for others to follow their works. We recommit ourselves to the greatness and the purpose that you've ordained. In your name we pray, Jesus Christ. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. 